but who has core convictions. And that's where, on all those fronts, Senator McCain wins hands down. And, you know, it doesn't matter just about answering the phone at 3 o'clock. It's uh, what your breadth of experience is and, and your character in dealing with crises. And it's not just at 3 o'clock in the morning. It's at 3 o'clock in the afternoon as well. And I think people in America are going to see that uh, Senator McCain is ready for prime time. Maybe could I just add one comment to Governor Huckabee's response to your question? I think our party is very unified. But I think that with his help and a lot of other people, we've got to energize our party more. And I think one of the aspects that dispirited our base was the spending. So we've got to assure people that we will be careful stewards of their tax dollars, as Governor Huckabee was when he was governor in this state and that we will not just let spending get completely out of control on unneeded and unnecessary and wasteful projects, no matter whether it be a literal combat ship that cost over, and there was a big front page story in one of the major newspapers this morning about that, or whether it be on uh, uh, billions of dollars wasted in the attempts to reconstruct New Orleans. And so I, th I think that we can, well, that our party is reunited, but we've got to energize them. And they've got to have, believe that we're going to be careful stewards of their tax dollars. We've seen discretionary spending go up in some figure estimates in the last two, between 2000 and 2007 by some 70 percent. And so I, I think that's, when, when I have interface with our voters, that it seems to me that spending they're worried about the economy, they're worried about the war in Iraq, they're worried about, it. but as far as our base core principles of the Republican Party, as far as being physical conservatives, is, is do you agree with that? Absolutely. Uh, and, and people understand, particularly in that economic slowdown, that their lives are being affected. They're having to cut back. We're watching food prices soar and fuel prices soar, and everything now is in a, a real tight turn for many working families. The one place they don't see any real uh, downturn in spending is at the federal government level. Senator McCain is a candidate who, as a senator, he doesn't just show up with some rhetoric. I mean, he's got the strongest record in the entire United States Senate of fighting wasteful spending. So he comes with a level of credibility that nobody else is going to have. So when he says to the American people, we're going to stop it, they're going to believe it. And I don't think anybody else can stand on the stage and match that. And that's going to be an important message throughout this whole year.